I think about that kind of stuff. Like if a plane crashed, I already know I'm planned ahead, dude. I'd eat a Vietnamese guy. Why? Um, because it's easy. It's a starter move. If you attack somebody bigger, <laughs> if you eat somebody bigger in front of other people, it's going to alarm people. But you, you got to eat a small person, so stature is important. I think if you gum down a Viet, people aren't going to be that upset at you. Well, the, the you know? Vietnamese people are going to be super upset. What are you talking about? No, well, somebody's okay. dad. Yeah, they're sacrifice. They're more <laughs> understanding of things, dude. Is this a character you're playing? No. <laughs> but if you eat a black dude, you eat a black lady and her family's there, they're going to be pissed. So you think a Vietnamese person would let you slide? I think that they'd be much more forgiving over a couple of day period. Mm, I think uh, like well, their relatives. You don't think so, honestly? Well, one thing, no, I don't think so. I definitely think they'd be super pissed at you, especially modernized ones. But what is interesting is like Vietnam is one of the few places where um, Americans can go back to Vietnam and they don't seem to have hold any grudge at all. Exhibit A. <laughs> Exhibit A, man. Honestly. <laughs> It, well, Asian people in general are, are just much more forgiving and understanding, it seems like. I feel yeah. like. I think. I mean, I don't have much. I think I think that's a giant generalization. It probably is, you know. I mean, I did a fast for like four days, and then I was at the Best Buy. And um, and I remember this Vietnamese guy was trying to help me out, and I couldn't even hear him. I was so hungry. <laughs> and I, I couldn't. You and, did a fast for four days? Oh, dude, yeah. Well, what were you I, trying to prove? I don't know, man. I was probably just dealing with some stuff, and I was just trying to find a different way to handle it, you know? Right. Um, and then I remember this Vietnamese guy, and I remember thinking, if everybody turned the other way for a second, I could eat this young fella. You know, Ben. <laughs> his name was Ben, actually, <laughs> over there in Westwood. Um, but I, And I'd oh never thought... Oh, my God. It's so ridiculous. But, well, I mean, but here's the thing. I'd never thought that before. So you only thought you got to the verge of cannibalism after just four days. Yeah. Damn. How much weight did you lose? I probably lost about four pounds, but pounds I needed too. You wow. Know? But I got clear, man. I could he And I could hear, swear to God, y'all could hear somebody fold a piece of bread from 80 feet away, bro. <laughs> I was so hungry, dude. I could hear a fucking skittle hit the cement <laughs> across the street. I really could, man. Do you think that it heightened your senses because your, your hunger was so sharp? 100%. And I could wow. see how people felt. I could see how people felt. If somebody wasn't feeling well, I could see it, man. Whoa. 